Hello Redmine users, in this video I'm going to show you our new help desk solution for Easy Redmine. So let's get started. The first thing you will notice is the help desk dashboard. Here you will find the queue of new tickets and workload per each user. You can easily preview each ticket and drag and drop it to users or type of tickets. It's a perfect solution for help desk manager. It provides you with a convenient and effective way of managing your tickets without actually leaving the dashboard. Also below you can find open non-development tickets per each user that allow you to track workload and how the SLAs are met. At your dashboard you can gather tickets from different sources, all of them at one place. There are three ways to create a ticket. You can set a ticket via customer portal, like this. It can be created from an email that is linked to your help desk. Or you can set a ticket via client account where a user with client's rules and permissions is able to create a new task for you. After assigning the tickets, you can easily monitor the progress using Kanban board, which you can use to track feature development tasks and bug fixing or any other process. Below, you can find a list of features that are awaiting approval or approved features that are in the queue for the sprint. For managers, Kanban gives a great overview of all the processes and it allows other help desk users to quickly and easily update statuses of each task, again using drag and drop, eliminating the need to update tasks manually. Here you can find help desk projects. Normally one project represents one company and projects can be further categorized. Colorful indicators show how timely the tickets are managed. Here you can also see the number of total, worked and remaining hours according to SLA. This gives you a great overview of the quality of your help desk and how well our SLA's agreements are met per each client. You can also use this great bar and pie chart to view your team performance and provide feedback to your team. You can compare different users, periods and statuses. Furthermore, there is a great variety of complex settings and functions. For example, you can make complex SLA settings like number of contractual hours, hours to response, and hours to resolve a task. You can also set SLA working days and working hours. These settings can help you to optimize and organize your workspace. You can find more complex settings and how to set them in our help desk cookbook. Thank you for watching and we wish you good luck in your future project.